welcome back. Welcome back to HIP, Health Insurance Personalized. This is Consumer's Doctor on the behalf of Foremost Organization. All right. We all know someone who takes the advantage of the situations. With Obamacare, there are plenty of ways you can get the insurance they want without paying their fair premiums, folks. Without paying their fair premiums. They're called free riders. So they're called free riders. Under the Obamacare, these free riders can deceptively claim lower income than they really have when enrolling. They would then get a large subsidy. They would get a large subsidy than they're entitled to. They can pay a few months of premium when sick and drop out. Then when recovered only to re-enroll later when sick. The uninsured can simply show up at a hospital emergency room and they're guaranteed care. They're guaranteed care. There has to be, so there has to be a cost of being voluntarily uninsured as long as we as a society, we as a society agree to compassionate care for all. Yes, that's what it's all about, compassionate care for all. When all said and done, in a voluntary system, there will always be those who choose not to be insured. There will always be few of them they choose not to be insured. Choice is good, but it is all, it's what we all want in the first place. Some insured individuals may be healthy and consider any insurance premiums as unnecessary expenses. You see? A few may even be rich enough to pay cash for any illness and all claims they may suffer. But just like there are 100% prob probability, 100% probability that we all die, at some point everyone will need health insurance to access healthcare, to access healthcare. When healthcare is ultimately needed by uninsured, any condition, illness, or accident presented, then will be considered as a pre existing condition. Only insurance option will be the impaired health support plans, impaired health support plans. Underli under the personalized health insurance, during the period of being uninsured, individuals will lose all or a portion of their personal or family income tax exemption. This is a big thing, folks. Yes they lose income tax exemption for an individual or a family. These funds will be used to support, these funds will be used to support the subsidies of the impaired health support plans, folks. Yes, they will support the impaired health support plans. Those voluntarily uninsured will be eventually, eventually, need the benefit of 
benefit of the impaired health support group. Consider the penalty. Consider the penalty. The forfeited funds, so-called forfeited funds, a prepayment pre, pre coverage. A prepayment of coverage by a voluntarily uninsured towards the impaired health support group. That's the beauty, folks. A prepayment of coverage by voluntarily uninsured towards the impaired health support group. The process to do, to do so is as follows. The State Department of Revenue and IRS will calculate the increased income tax from returns showing the loss of exemptions, loss of exemptions, and submit that the tax amount to cover the claims and other expenses of the impaired health support group, folks. Im impaired health support. Low income individuals in need of financial help can get a premium subsidized insurance. So ultimately what will happen the loss of federal and state personal tax deductions helps to finance the impaired health support plans for those choose to be uninsured, but eventually will eventually be uninsurable for those folks. So this is the solution folks under the personalized health care. If they choose not to be insured, they will lose all the tax exemptions. I, I, and this, I hope you get it. They lose the uh, individual and family tax exemption. As a result, state and the federal government will be collected more revenue. That revenue go, goes towards the impaired health support groups. This is better than mandating under the Obamacare. This is better. When they lose the exemptions, we will be collecting more tax revenue from these folks. So that is the best solution under the personalized health care. Thank you for joining us. If you, do if you do like it, do subscribe, share, and hit that notification bell. We will see you in the next episode.